Okay, before I move into set number 13, let me come back around to this set just so I can show you this gloss on. It's the Lotus Shimmer New um, Beyond Gloss Shade. I'm going to take, this was pomegranate um, jelly. I'm gonna take that off. And I'm gonna show you um, what this looks like. I'm probably gonna need to do a little bit of concealer, foundation, left over from my brush to neutralize my lip for these next few steps. Okay, Lotus Shimmer. This one, I forget what, how they described it, but it's like a warm berry, I think is what they said. Okay. I love these applicators so much because they have like the tip to be able to be precise and the well inside that you don't have to go back in to grab more, it's like the perfect amount. That is pretty. So this is Lotus Shimmer and it's part of that Going Places makeup kit, I think is what it's called. Boop. Okay, now let me take this off. We're gonna do the next set, set 13, and this is a fan favorite, fan favorite, mini beyond gloss. <laughs> We're gonna put all these on. Okay, let me do a little bit of this. Goodbye, Lotus Shimmer. And I'm going to, let me put a little bit of concealer on my hand here. Okay, now back to neutral. Mini Beyond Gloss, four mini Beyond Glosses um, in this vault. The names of these, let's see if I'm gonna get these in the right direction. This is Wildberry. This is Cappuccino. This is Cranberry Shimmer. And this is Cosmic Shimmer. I am excited about Cappuccino. Okay, I think we had Wildberry in a past, in a past um, holiday set. Let's put that one on. Uh, that one's the darkest. Let me start with Cosmic Shimmer. Looks like it's almost like a clear. Cosmic Shimmer, maybe a light pink with some iridescent kind of sparkles. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Super easy to wear. Would be a great topper because it definitely has a little bit of um, shift on it that you can see that you're wearing something. It's not just like a clear gloss necessarily. But if you tap it out, it gets a little bit more neutral. This looks really good with these this eye makeup because it is a little bit more bold than I normally would wear, which I'm actually probably gonna try to take this off here for a bit um, when I get to another set that's got a little bit of a bold lift going on. Okay, let me take this off. Not too hard to take this one off. Okay. Let me try cappuccino. Cappuccino. This is, this is what I like. Um, all of our Beyond Glosses, if you've never tried them in our normal, um, you know, core line, infused with vanilla, um, they are just lovely to wear. They're not sticky. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I am a sucker for a warm lip doesn't go with this eye look necessarily. So try to think that I'm not wearing pink. This is worth getting that entire set for. Okay, next. These two will go with the eye look a little bit more. This is Cranberry Shimmer. I don't think I said the price of this yet. I'll grab that in a second. I also feel like we might've had this one in the past. I'm not sure this is a new shade. Yeah, I think we have. It's pretty. So the shift in this picks up like pink a little more with like a berry red base. Pretty bold. I usually wouldn't pair this unless I guess it was like a fancy night out. I usually do one or the other, bold lip or bold eye. 
Okay, and then the last one, this one is a, it has no shimmer in it, Wildberry. We definitely have had this one before. It reminds me of Raspberry in our core line. It's just a little bit more red. So pretty. I don't know how I'm doing these in the phone alone with some of these shades. I'm a magician. That is a gorgeous shade of like fuchsia pink. Remember to tap these out if they're too much. You can always, you know, get a lighter look or build up to more bold. Okay, so those were the four Beyond Gloss Vault. Oop. I love cappuccino. Pretty much obsessed with that.